16 people have been killed after part of a ventilation window collapsed at an outdoor concert. Now, the official says two dozen people fell about 10 meters. Nine people are reportedly seriously injured. Let's talk about the battle against ISIS. How is it going? Uh, what is the state of play right now? Well, that answer depends on who you ask. Uh, we have heard the White House say thus far it is a success. And now a new admission from the man heading up the war, General John Allen, saying despite the strikes, they're retaining, quote, tactical momentum, particularly Anbar province. This is Baghdad's backyard, which has now been largely overrun by ISIS militants. You see all the red there on your screen, who now control an estimated 80%. These pictures here? This is the first we have seen of the militants who are now in control of one of the largest air bases they have since uh, gone on to target another. Iraqi security forces cutting and running. Uh, this is a chorus of U.S. officials continuing to insist Baghdad not in danger. Jim Shudo, Chief National Security Correspondent, joining me now. And uh, Jim Shudo, you just got out of a news conference with General John Allen. What did he say? Well, let me tell you, it's a pretty remarkable admission from the president's point man for the fight against ISIS to say, as you said, Brooke, that ISIS maintains the momentum in Anbar province just to the west of Baghdad, within striking distance of Baghdad, especially considering all the resources, all the firepower that the U.S. and the coalition are devoting there. The airstrikes, certainly, but also additional steps in recent weeks, including the use of Apache helicopters, attack mm -hmm. helicopters, low-flying, slow-flying helicopters, helicopters at greater risk, and the thousands of Iraqi troops fighting ISIS there. Have a listen to how uh, General Allen uh, described the situation there. I'd be careful about assigning a winner, winner or a loser. We had uh, come in uh, early along with the intention that uh, the airstrikes were to buy white space uh, to uh, impede the tactical momentum of, uh, of ISIL. Uh, and that, in fact, uh, has occurred in some areas. Uh, they still retain some tactical momentum in other areas. Uh, and that's to be expected. Uh, they, uh, we're only new into this uh, strategy. We're only new into the use of airstrikes. Like I said in some areas, uh, Amrli, uh, Mosul Dam, Haditha, uh, those airstrikes were uh, very helpful. Uh, we're actually focusing, obviously, around Kobani, providing airstrikes to provide humanitarian assistance and relief there, obviously, to give some time to the, uh, the fighters to organize on the ground. But in the Anbar province, uh, our hope is to stop or halt that, uh, that tactical initiative and momentum that they have there. These pictures here. 16 people have been killed after part of a ventilation window collapsed at an outdoor concert. Now, the official says two dozen people fell about 10 meters. Nine people are reportedly seriously injured. Let's talk about the battle against ISIS. How is it going? Uh, what is the state of play right now? Well, that answer depends on who you ask. Uh, we have heard the White House say